What's going on, Assassins? It's Dark Strider, and it's time for the Taco Tuesday trifecta. We begin with Assassin's Creed Valhalla. So, huh, let's see. Twilight Hood. This should be 120 opal. That's the daily. Loga Fudugur, 150 opal. Hopefully I said that correctly. That's a skin for your raven. Sword of the Damned, 120 opal. Then we have Zhuk, 150 opal. That's another skin for your raven. The Brain Smasher, which is a Divine Hammer, that should be 120 Opal. The Werewolf Left Arm Tattoo for 35, and the Knight Isu Sail for 35. So, not too impressive. I would have liked to see maybe some more gear, maybe some more weapons. But, I mean, for all of you skin collectors, you got that there. And it looks like we have a full set. In Svartalheim, we have the three dailies and the one weekly, which is stuff that you could only get in Svartalheim. But before we even do that, let's go for our free weekly item. Let's see what we've got here. I've been having some good luck lately. Uh, I've had a couple of weeks in a row where I had great stuff, and my luck ran out. The Knight Isu back tattoo, don't congratulate me. That's crap, dude. Well, it was free. Didn't pay for it. So I guess it is what it is. Anyway, we begin with Murderer on the Loose. And there is a guy who we actually have to take out. He's flanked by three other people. This is not the weekly, though. This is kind of like a mini version of the weekly. And what we want to do is assassinate the actual bag holder. It's easiest to do from the sky like this. And then take out the rest of the guys for whatever lootables they have and whatnot. This will give you 5 opal, 300 XP, and the other way to do that, as I've said before, you could actually just take a sleep arrow and knock the person out or knock the group out and then assassinate the guy in the center. It takes way less time to assassinate and just get the stuff than it does to actually sit there and confirm the kill. To confirm the kill, while it only takes a few seconds, to me, you know, every second counts, especially when I want to get off this game and play a bunch of the other better games that are out there currently. Anyway, uh, the next up we have Not a Moosebull Crate, and this one is something similar to Midgard, where we're supposed to go and find these carts and light them on fire by, you know, either torch, an incendiary weapon, or just shooting at the uh, powder kegs that are on the carts. But it's bugged. As you get closer, as you can see in the upper left-hand corner, the bar will start to fill white. The cards start to destroy themselves. You can either do this on horseback and get closer, or you could do this by just sending your raven as I'm doing. In completing that, you will get 5 opal and 300 XP without even having to do anything, with only sending your raven or just getting close to it. After that, we have the Kyra's Challenge, which is... Basically, we're going to go over to the Valkyrie Arena. We're going to select Retta's Challenge, and then we're going to enter an arena fight. It'll be between one and four chapters, which are actually rounds. And what we're going to do is just take everything out that we see. Uh, there are also going to be boasts, or they may be boasts. I haven't had boasts in a long time because I've completed this several times. But boasts are kind of like handicaps. It makes the fight a little bit harder for you, and it increases the amount of tokens that you will get for the Valkyrie store. You know, those little tokens you could get. I think they have like a bunch of different uh, runes that you could get. And later on, it's just materials after you get all the runes and other items. So once you complete that, though, it'll give you 5 opal, 300 XP. And of course, it'll give you a bunch of tokens based on how many uh, boasts you had active while this was going on. All right. Finally, we have the Lord of Strife. And this is the Midgard version of the Joms Vikinger code. And what you want to do is take them all out. Uh, you, mainly, you want to take out the person in the middle. Uh, the easiest way to do that is by assassination. Or, you know, in Svartalheim, you could assassinate from the sky. Uh, the other way you could do it is you could assassinate. Like, I, if I would have picked the right person, I could have got it this way. Or, like I said before, use the arrows, the sleep arrows to knock them all out and then 
take them out by assassination rather than confirming the kill. And you could do that with the Jums Vikinger code. Jums Vikinger code, they have the Viking in the center, you gotta take him out. And then you can take out the other guys for like their lootables, uh, other drops, rooms that they have, all kinds of stuff like that. And, um, you know, that, that just makes it easy for completing that. You'll get 300 XP and 20 Opal because, of course, it is the weekly. So anyway, that's the selection that we have for this week. Uh, it's always nice to start off the dailies with a divine item or you know a special item gear piece uh weapon but yeah i gotta see what happens for the rest of the week anyway let me know what you think as far as the skins go and the selection other than that i hope you enjoyed the video please make sure you like and subscribe it helps this channel out an awful lot as always i want to thank each and every one of you for watching and until next time take care be good stay safe take care of each other i'll see you all in the next one Ya yeah, yee! Yeah.